Today we were working on a simulation, uh, his name is Hal, and we were checking out his vitals, checking out his breathing efforts, his circulatory status, and then we were looking at the monitor to check out his heart rate, his oxygen stats, um, and check to see if there were any changes in his condition. It's really hard sometimes to teach a student how to take care of a person when you're using a rubber mannequin. They don't act the same, they don't talk the same, they don't sound the same. How now with the new technology that we have, we can set him up so he sounds like a real patient. He responds to what they've done to him. Pupils change, heart sounds change, lung sounds change, vital signs change um, in response to what they're doing or how his condition changes. So it makes it a little more lifelike for the students. A simulation this great is good for my education because I actually do like get to hear different assessment pieces. I get to hear what a strider respiratory effort sounds like and I've never heard that in the clinical setting. So seeing and hearing different things in assessment pieces that I don't see out in the real world setting yet, we get to have that experience beforehand before actually hitting the, the hospital floors.